Hey there, our beautiful viewers. Welcome back to your favorite channel. Today we are got a topic that is all about becoming the best version of yourself. Okay, first of all let me give a chance to ask a question. Are you texting with a someone? Do you know the habit of high value person? If you do not know, I will tell you about it. So now you have idea about today's topic. 12 texting habits of a high value person. So are you ready to level up your communication game? You know the problem is not everyone knows how to text effectively. Texting is all about context. Without right context, our text can be easily misinterpreted. After watching this video, you will learn the psychology of texting and how to text with people in right way. Then why are we waste time in here? Let's dive right in. Number one, clear communication. First habit is clear communication. High value men are the master of clear communication. They avoid confusing things and go to the point directly. They try to give everything correctly. They ensure their messages are concise, well-structured, and easily comprehensive. They try to use simple language without making it difficult. If we can tell something easily, why are we using some difficult way to do it? Always they try to make their text without vague statements or ambiguous phrases. With this they make it easy for the recipient to understand their intention. They avoid using emojis that might cause for some misunderstandings. By using this clear communication method, high value men try to demonstrate respect for the recipient's time and intelligence. It fostering meaningful and productive conversations. Because of this, they try to value others' time and their time also. They try to make sure their messages are crystal clear. Number two, prompt replies. High value men are people who respect their time and also others' time. People who value others' time and their time make it a point to respond in a timely manner. They try to exhibit prompt with this. They recognize the importance of their time and the time of the person they are communicate with. When they see message, they aim to reply promptly. Try to show respect and consideration for the ongoing conversation. They practice reflects their commitment to effective communication and also try to maintaining a positive rapport with others. They try to contribute to the smooth flow of conversations and also demonstrate their attentiveness to the discussions at hand. For this, they try to provide messages in timely manner. It is sign of respect and consideration. Number three, focus conversations. If someone going out of track and try to discuss about random topics, it waste your time. And also it is like they don't respect about your conversation because they talk about their own things. This is habit of low value men. But high value men always try to stay on track and keep their conversations on track. They showcase focused conversations in their texting style. To do this, they staying on topic and avoiding unnecessary tangents. These individuals always understand the value of maintaining a clear direction in their discussion. If they engaging with a conversation, they try to keep their messages relevant to the subject matter and try to ensure that the exchange remains purposeful and meaningful. They demonstrate their ability to engage in productive and insightful dialogues. These kind of habits not only showcase their respect for the other person's time, but also reflects their commitment to effective communication and exchanging valuable insights. Number four, respectful tone. Let's move into habit number four. It is respectful tone. Using a polite and respectful language when you texting with others one of key habits. They try to choose words with consideration, courtesy, and politeness. They try to avoid using disrespectful language, sarcasm, or offensive remarks. They know the importance of treating others with dignity. Regardless of the nature of conversation, they always try to use polite messaging way. By maintaining a respectful tone, they create a positive and welcoming atmosphere. They try to show that they always value other the recipient's feelings and opinions. This create a strong connection based on mutual respect. Because of this, their image will be improved. Number five, active listening. High value men are also great at active listening. They genuinely engaging with the content of the messages they receive. They read attentively and respond thoughtfully. Instead of rushing for the reply, they try to absorb the meaning of message and give a thoughtful reply. These kind of things leads for a deeper connection and understanding. They address the point and acknowledge the emotions and thoughts. 
they try to share emotions with other person. They show respect through texts and try to give empathy, enriching the quality of their interactions. Try to always show your respect the way you using your language and emojis, because it shows who you are. Number six, meaningful questions. High value individuals employ meaningful questions when they are texting with others. They show genuine curiosity and interest in the other person's thoughts and experiences. They ask thoughtful and open-ended questions. It encourages deeper co-connections. They try to learn more about the person they are communicating with, and they try to show that they really try to understand other person even through texts. It shows their genuine care. They create atmosphere where other person can tell what they want without any hesitation. It create a situation for meaningful exchange and show their commitment to building connections based on understanding and shared perspectives. They are curious and ask questions that show genuine interest in understanding. If you messaging with these kind of person, you find that if is very easy to do it. Number seven, empathetic texting. These individuals try to display emotional intelligence even through texts. Try to acknowledge with other person thoughts and validating their feelings. They demonstrate their emotional intelligence through words. They acknowledge and validate feelings expressed in the conversation. When someone share their thoughts or emotions, they reply with empathy and compassion. It makes the other person heard and supported. Their messages convey a sense of caring and a willingness to be present for the other person's emotions. With this other person can share whatever things in their mind because they feel that this person value emotions and thoughts. Imagine when you texting and other one try to understand you and give a courage to share your feelings, it feels really valuable. With these kind of things, both parties feel valued and understood it create a good foundation. Number eight, consistency. High value men strikes a balance with their texting frequency. They try to be neither overwhelming and being sporadic. They try to maintain a balanced and reliable communication pattern. They don't flood the conversation with excessive messages. Also, they don't disappear for a long time without explanation. Instead this, they engage with regular communication. By being consistently present and responsive, they establish a sense of trust and reliability. They try to respect the rhythm of the conversation and the recipient's time. They try to uplift the overall quality of the communication and the connections they form. It leads for a trust and good conversation. Number 9. Boundaries. Habit number 9 is that they respect others' personal boundaries by understanding when and what to communicate. They always recognize the importance of giving space for personal time and other commitments. These individuals respect the boundaries set by the other person. They always recognize their own and the other person's limit. If other one is not comfortable with what they asking, they immediately stop the topic and try to text about another topic. With these observing boundaries, they create solid and balanced texting dynamic. It leads for healthy communication and give a sense of mutual respect. Remember when you texting with someone, always recognize their limits and try to respect them. It will leads for a good communication. Number 10. Quality over quantity. High value men value the quality of their conversations over the number of messages they shared. They focused on crafting thoughtful and meaningful messages. Their texts are purposeful, containing relevant informations or questions they add value to the interaction. With these they avoid overwhelming the other person with an excessive volume of messages. These highlights their consideration about recipient's time. With these their messages are very short and give more informations towards other one. Number 11. Positive reinforcement. They try to uplift other person with positive texts. They use positive language and providing encouragement to the person they are communicating with. They try to give genuine compliments and try to appreciate others' thoughts. They always try to put supportive messages and create a post of atmosphere that boosts recipient mindset. Imagine that when you go through hard times, someone try to give you encouragement with their texts. How it is feel? So good, right? This practice foster a sense of validation and also strengthens the bind between them. They try to demonstrate their ability to uplift other person in empowering texting dynamic. Number 12. Problem Solutions Last habit is problem solutions. 
Instead of avoid problems, high value men try to address issues maturely, aiming for solutions. They hate ignoring or escalating issues. They try to focus on mature and respectful discussion to find solutions. They always remain clam, no matter how big the problem is, they know they there is a solution for that. They also give that confident to other one. They seek to understand the concerns of all parties involved and work collaboratively towards resolving the problem. They demonstrate their emotional intelligence, conflict resolution skills. With this they can solve any problem so well and without any dramas. And also they give peace to other person. So this is the end of over video. 12 Texting Habits of a High Value Person Now you know what are the effective messaging methods. Try to get at least one quality for you. It improve yourself and build stronger connections and showcase you best self. Try to be a valuable person even through texts. We think that this video help you for that. So if you find this video is interesting hit the like button. Do you forget to subscribe us? Don't worry you can do it now. Hit the subscribe button and also bell icon. Then you will never miss our videos. See you in the next one.